What's up, everyone? We're here with the legend of uh, South Beach, Miami, Dude Skywalker, thank you, thank Alex, you. Fabio. So I have like a couple questions. First of all, how you enjoy Sarasota? It was amazing. Yeah, yeah definitely, awesome uh, definitely more than I expected, man, for yeah. sure. So, uh, so hospitality was great. So Halloween weekend, you guys nailed like three restaurants last night. How's the vibe? How's the compared to Miami Beach? What is the feeling you got the groove last night? I felt good. I mean, I think I think I love the fact that the city seems like it has a lot more to grow, you know, and I think for the scene in general, it's a really good thing. Uh, and actually it exceeded my expectations. You know, when we first got here, I wasn't expecting it to be as live with the scene and it actually uh, did really well. So I'm, I'm happy to come back and actually continue playing here. I really enjoyed it. Looking forward. So Fabio, I guess you guys the really big and burning man and you on part of the big of the organization, the called, camp called Mickey Beach, right? Yes, Mickey Beach. Mm -hmm. So tell us a little bit about it. So Mickey Beach is a Miami, New York based Burning Man camp. Uh, we're essentially a South Beach party sound camp uh, at Burning Man. And uh, we're going on year five now. Year five. Year five for, for Mickey Beach. And it's been an amazing run so far. Um, talent from all over the world playing the camp. Uh, but it's, it's always for us, it's a, it's a fun creative endeavor to, you know, to just like push, push our boundaries. You know? And that's how we met you. That's cool. Yeah. So, yeah. so I worked out. The Burning Man, that's correct. Exactly. So uh, two more questions and then we're good to go. So uh, how you guys, when you, what time, what point in life you guys decided you're going to take you're going to take your life to the next level and you're going to make a living of producing music. And I know you guys resident in the Space Club, do not sit on the furniture mm -hmm. and Mickey Beach and what else? Well, yeah. Electric Pickle. Electric Pickle, yeah, right? Electric Pickle is actually reopening now. Um, we got a couple projects in the works right now. We can't really give any too much out, but uh, right. so we're definitely you... still at Space, at Floyd, at Do Not Sit, at all the big clubs in Miami. And when you guys decide that that's it, we're going to make and living with guys together and it was after, I would say it was after Burning Man. It was after, after our bur our first burn. That was uh, 2001. 2014. Uh, we were already, uh, you know, DJing. We just had day jobs. We were working for big corporate companies, and uh, definitely going to Burning Man. You know, we really Pretty much quit our jobs. Yeah, we <laughs> thought about it. Came back and we're like, you know, what do we want to do for a living? Do we want to dress up and and play actor, or do we want to chase our dreams and do what we love? And I think the answer is. It's pretty obvious, you know? Right, then you guys, how, when the first time you guys had the first gig in your life together, did you decide to become with Dude Skywalker? So we, we actually met in college and we, par we partied a lot. We threw a lot of parties. That's kind of like our background together. And then once we, once we graduated, we, we were, you know, one weekend we just said, hey, let's, let's start working on music. He, him and another previous partner had, had, had been dabbling in production and we just made a song and it took off on the blogosphere and our and, and, the, our and the UM radio off, and in the radio it took off in, then, in Miami radio University and then of Miami. Next thing we know, we're, we're we're throwing parties at Bardo, which was our first residency, and so many, that's really where like it took off. That's know? awesome. So many people asking me, so how you come up with Dude Skywalker? What is just in the final question, Fabio? Oh, like we were we were uh, we were creative on a strain uh, Skywalker OG. Oh wow! <laughs> and, yeah, and it then, was time for medicine, and, uh, and it, it was back we, when, when, yeah. when like Daft Punk was like really in, and mystery was a thing. So we the like, whole name make it was sound singular, right? So the whole name was essentially to be a singular name that we can hide behind under, like a mask and alias that we can hide behind under, so no one really knows who we are. Uh, you know, Fabio with his long hair and his name, I think it's uh, it's pretty hard to miss this guy. You know, yeah, so uh, word got out pretty quickly, but you know that's fine. It, it comes with it, and and we embrace it. So it's that's cool. good. So the final question: When is the next gig? Tonight. The next gig <laughs> is in like uh, eight hours. <laughs> okay. Tonight, Proyecto Tulum in Miami. Uh, Saturday, we're doing Raise the Dead Festival with Sabo, Homar, Nico Stoyan, and a whole bunch of other guys in Miami as well. And then on Sunday, we have uh, the Daybreaker uh, right next to the American Daybreaker. Airlines Daybreaker. Arena. Daybreaker, that's supposed to be the new thing. Today, that's right? the new thing. Right? It's a wellness, sober party. It's beautiful. You definitely got to come check it out. Pure love and spirit. Pure, it's a that's pure all moment it and lots, lots, and lots of energy. It's so, amazing. As a DJ, it's amazing. 
got the dolphins in the water. That's so cool right now. Yeah. So SIQ Beats was honored to have you guys in Sarasota. It was a pleasure, Looking brother. Looking forward to the next gig together and next. Gig together. or no gig, I'm coming back. So, okay. you know, you're stuck with us. All right. Absolutely, brother. Right. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Thank you for coming. It was an awesome time. And you guys incredible. Pleasure, bro. Appreciate it. Thank Cheers, you. guys. SIQ Beats.